Hi Jurassic Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw Rose from Blackpink's Ice Cream Music video. So let's get started. To draw Rose, let's start by drawing a bottom of a U for her face. So I'm going to come right here, start, curve, and I'm going to bring this right across, uh, let's say about right here, and connect it at the bottom. So that's a basic shape we're try trying to aim to draw. It's very delicate. <laughs> okay, so then from there, let's come back to where we started and towards the edge, we're gonna draw a big circle for her eyes. So it's the same thing on the other side, about right here. Towards the edge. And let's make them draw so cute eyes. So come in here with two small circles for highlights. And a curved line at the bottom. And shade in the top. and lines at the bottom and same thing over here. So if you love Rose here from her ice cream video, Blackpink's ice cream video, definitely check out um, the one that I just did with Selena Gomez. And of course, let me know in the comments below if there's you want me to finish the whole group from this uh, video. Thank goodness there's only four uh, members in Blackpink, right? And not like 10. <laughs> okay, so we have her eyes in. I'm just gonna make this a little bit rounder. There. Okay, so then let's come, um, say about right here. I'm gonna continue this curve out and give her one thick lash. It's kind of like her eyeliner fishtail eyeliner so come right here and thicken one strand and just to spruce it up I'm going to come to the bottom and just draw another curve at the bottom there okay so then let's come to the top of her eye say about right here I'm just going to draw a soft arc for her brow and I'll just slightly thicken it up and same thing over here This is a soft arc. Okay, so then let's give Rose a sweet smile. So right here, let's come up the curve and cap it off. And then now let's, uh, let's see here. Let's imagine her face as a big oval. So, and her hair parts in the center. So I'm going to say about right here. I'll just give myself a point about right there. And from there, I'm going to draw two strands of hair. So her hair is up in a ponytail. And I'm just going to bring this curve down to where I started. And on this side, I'm going to give it a little more of a wave to break it up. And so let's come down right here. I'm going to draw this strand. I'm just going to bring it down, curve it out. And it's coming about right here. I'm going to thicken this strand up. And so then on this side, I'm going to come out and I'm going to bring it out this way. Just giving it some movement so it's not so stiff. Bit. 
Okay, so then from there, let's, this is the center. We're going to go up. So let's imagine, say about right here, give myself a point. And from here, I'm gonna go up on both sides. So we're starting to part her hair. And before, let's see here. You can still see part of her ear. So, um, hmm, can we, yeah, let's tuck it in about right here. It's a little part of her ear. So depending on how big your strand is, so about right here. So indication of her ear. Then from there, we can go about right here and tuck in her hair. So let's go up, give it a slight angle and bring it right back down. So same thing over here, slight angle. And just tuck it right in. And then in between here and there, you can add some curves right here for some details. And that is pretty much it for her hair right here. And then we still have her little, um, her ponytail we'll draw later. So let's draw her body. So let's come um, right here in the center. And we're gonna neck. Come down with a curve for her shoulder right there and same thing here down shoulder okay so then let's imagine her armpit area so say about right here and here we're too low on the other side about right here and from there i'm going to draw a slight angle line Now we can go ahead and draw the top. So I'm going to continue this. So she's wearing a tank top. And then right here, her collar. It's kind of squarish. So just connect that. And I'll bring this down a little bit more for her top. And then right here, I'm going to go ahead and connect it. The center is going to be lower and then go back up. And then let's come back down right here. So just imagine her waist. We're going to see a little bit part of her waist right here. And then right here, I'm going to wobble a curve across. Just to simplify, I'm just going to wobble a curve across because she has this very shaggy uh, skirt, right? So to create this uh, shaggy feathery skirt that she has, we're going to uh, be drawing a bunch of zigzags. So I'm going to come right here, but we still want to make sure we're still going into the shape of the uh, skirt. So let's come right here and I'm just going to lightly back and forth these little strokes. Just back and forth, just like a zigzag, back and forth. Flick it out sometimes, going this way, going that way. It's all up to you. So you just want to lightly flick down, out, mix it up. Okay, so then as we come down here, I'm going to start to bring it in for the end, for the bottom part. So it's just a bunch of back and forth strokes to create this texture hopefully <laughs> so something like that it's just harder to do with a sharpie because it's so harsh and then if you like you can come in here and um, just extend some of these lines it out here a little bit more so it's 
shape is a little bit better. So just same thing here. Okay, so then um, I'll come in there with details a little bit later and let's draw her legs. So I'll uh, find the center, say about right here and here. I'm going to go ahead and draw angle line down. So her legs are just nice and straight. And we're getting thinner as we come down. So about right there. Okay, so then about right there, I'll cut it off, add some socks, and then cut it off again. And then right here, I'm going to start with her shoes. So I'm just going to bring it down and flare it out. And connect. So same thing over here. Socks first. And the shoes. Okay, so then um, let's draw, since we're down here, let's go ahead and finish off these shoes. So curve right here, bottom part here with sole, and then the two sides. Curve and laces. So same thing here. And laces and then her arms. So this side is just coming right down, so nice and simple right on this side. Just bring this down, come out to our armpit area. Let's bring this down more. So about right here. And I'm gonna give her a thumb. And then her fingers. And then on this side, her hands on her hips. So, but right here, same thing. Just gonna curve it out. And about right here, just bring it right into her hip and angle out for her hands. bring it in and then angle for her hand and then give a little curve right here at the bottom so it's kind of tucked in and you won't really see most of her hand because she has a shaggy skirt <laughs> okay so um, and then her uh, ponytail right here before I forget so let's tuck it in about right here Do a curve and it's going to come through and I'll just tuck it in right there. Okay, so then from there, let's see. Uh, let's draw some details on the skirt. So she has these like black feathers. So here and there, I'll just kind of an indication of these feathers. Kind of like drawing a leaf. shape right here So as you notice, I'm just kind of going at different angles, just spreading it out. Uh, maybe one here. And one here. Okay, so that in between, you can um, just add some texture as well. 
by putting in these zigzags. Hopefully I'm making this a little bit easier for you to follow along. Maybe I shouldn't have picked this outfit for her, huh? <laughs> okay. But I really like this outfit, so I felt I wanted to try this and give it a try. There, there's her skirt. Um, and then from there, let's draw the cute little Dalmatian puppy that's on her um, top right here. So um, we're going to definitely simplify it. So let's come right here. We're going to start with the eyes first. So two small circles. And then a nose. And then the face. Let's go around it. And then the top of the head, so about right here. And the floppy ears. And same thing on this side. No curve for the brow. And then the body. So let's come about right here and just draw two curves out. Okay, so then let's make it look like a Dalmatian. So we're going to give it some spots here and there. And since I need to put a heart, I'm going to make one of his spots a big heart right here in the center. There. <laughs> so um, hopefully that helped you draw Rose here from Blackpink in their uh, ice cream music video. And you love how this turned out. And I made it fun and easy for you to follow along with me. Thanks so much for watching. And um, hopefully you love this. And if you do, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.